Welcome to the Stay Curious Coding Foundations course for middle school students. Now think about this, right? You can be playing outside right now, or you can be playing a video game right now, or you can be watching someone stream a video game, or you can just be sleeping right now. But instead of doing any of those things, you are here. And that means that you are curious. And I know that you want to understand concepts deeply and also enjoy learning. And the first step to enjoying learning and understanding concepts deeply is to ask your own curious questions. So what are those curious questions for which the answers are hidden in this course? The first one is, what is this coding thing exactly? Is it different from programming? Is it different from this new word called hacking? Uh, are all these the same? Are they different? And why bother learning programming in the first place? Now, along with this, I have like a naughty question that I was curious about. Hey, what if you already know coding? Maybe you already know it. Maybe all the human beings who were manufactured after the year 2000, they came with a coding chip pre-installed, you know, like open the USB stick and plug it in. How do you know that's not true? Because if it is, then no need to attend any classes, watch any videos, it's solved, right? Think about that. Another question I have is, what came first? Did coding come first or did computers come first? Was coding there before computers? Think about it. Another question I have is also, why are there so many programming languages? Wouldn't one do? Like, it should have been enough, right? And they keep telling me that, you know, computers only understand zeros and ones, zeros and ones. But then none of the coding programming languages that I use, I ever wrote zeros and ones. Then what is this whole thing about computers only understanding zeros and ones? And finally, another question I have for you is, is block-based programming even real programming? Like many students I talk to say, so real programming means that it should happen on a black screen with some green text or some blue screen with some white text. It should look very serious. This is not real coding. Or is it? Now the answers to this and many more questions are hidden in this course. But you learn best when you learn actively. So along with asking these questions, the course has been divided into three seasons. At the end of season one, you'll build a Captain America's shield or something else that you love. And in season two, you'll build a project like the Harry Potter's sorting hat game, which basically tells you which house you belong to. And eventually in season three, put many more things together and build your own variation of the space shooter game or something else similar that you like. Now, by building these projects, you will understand some foundational concepts of programming, like loops, nested loops, conditionals, events, variables, sprites, and how to put them all together, how to debug code by building your own projects, and also how to use functions to make your code more modular and easy to read. Now, these concepts that you learn, you can then apply to any language that you want to learn. These are foundational ideas that you can apply across all languages. Now, just before you jump in and start learning, I want to let you know that these videos, I didn't make them to be viewed passively on YouTube. I made them to power the classrooms at Stay Curious, where students use them to actively learn, build, and discuss. So to help you get a taste of active learning, what I want you to do is there's a link in the description of all these videos where you can log into our next live experience, where you can ask all the questions that you had, interact with us, and learn even deeper. And also, in some of these videos, there'll be a link to a programming environment where you can go and actually practice the concept that's being discussed or build the project that's been, that's been discussed in the video. Now with this, you're ready to unleash yourself, jump in with all your curiosity, and enjoy learning actively.